Hello, users, and welcome to another episodic installation of Above It All. And today we're going to talk about Nancy Pelosi getting her hair done and not wearing a mask. Well, we got a little video here from the Trump War Room, MAGA. Science that says you must test, tra trace, treat, you must wear your mask, you must have sanitation, you must wear your mask, you must wear your mask. The science that... I love it. I love it. So I'm going to have this play on loop. Um, but again, let's talk about this because this is a whole... This is one of the things that the Trump campaign does is they will just take any Democrat politician and they'll say, look at this guy, dang, Libertarian liberal. Like, they would have done it against Bernie, even though it's clearly not true. Now they can do it against Joe, because it clearly is true. And it's a good strategy, because Nancy Pelosi is a loser. She's a dullard. She's dumb as rocks. And she's an awful person. And this is the problem. When you've got the Republican Party, which is a far-right neo-fascist party, and you've got a Democrat party, which is a far-right, like, Maybe not a neo-fascist party, maybe like a classical fascist party, you know. They kind of want to expand the empire, but they don't want to, you know, burn any bridges while they get there. And it's just like, it's just like, well, what are we doing in this country? You know, we have a majority of people that don't vote. You know, we have a majority of people that don't care about politics. What are we doing? We're really going to let these people rule our government? People say, oh, well, it's all corrupt. Why give a shit? I don't know. Go outside break something protest this shouldn't be our government full of rich gangster wannabe mobsters you have donald trump saying that mail-in ballots should be banned yet he uses them in florida you've got nancy pelosi saying a mask should have nationally mandated yet she doesn't wear them and she goes to a hair salon who needs to go to a hair salon like come on like it's ridiculous like, have, like, a private stylist come to your office or something. You're rich. You're a multimillionaire. What is this? But it's embarrassing. These people are embarrassing. Red team to blue team. They're all not on our team. And we really need to think about this kind of stuff. People love to say, well, Trump's different. Trump's a multimillionaire billionaire. And he's this. He's the one good one. What? He's the one good one? We've heard this story many, many times before. Barack Obama's gonna go in there and change things. Biden's gonna restore the soul of this nation. What? None of these people are good. They're all con artists. Let's go out and let's protest this bitch ass government until it ceases to exist. Thank you for watching. And also, fuck you, Nancy Pelosi. What a dullard.